Live from Seattle continues on 820 AM KGNW. This is a, a really interesting, a neat ministry, Missions Aviation Training Academy. And we've got Gary Elliott with us. Gary, welcome to the program. Hi, good to be here. Thanks. And then Gordon. And Gordon, I didn't get you. Oh, Gordon. Bucky. So this is the idea of <clears throat> training uh, pilots uh, to be, who are going to be missionaries, are going to be working with missionaries. Yeah, that's, that's what it is. One, what is the uniqueness? Why is that needed versus just someone getting a pilot license? Yeah, you go down to uh, Payne Field, Boeing Field, pilot's license, get legally, you're a pilot. Yeah. But you're not prepared to go on that brush, push trips. Yeah, so they're operating off, you know, strips uh, or, you know, paved runways that are 9,000 feet long or more at yeah. those airports, training pilots for corporate or jets or airline pilots. So, we're training guys to work off a really short, uh, narrow, rugged strips. Well, that seems like they'd be kind of scary to train people to do that. Because part of, I can see a flight school where you just do the very, you know, the most safe, secure kind of, you know, pain field uh, versus this idea. How do you bring someone through that process? Do you start them kind of, you know, is the first stage is general flight, then, then you yeah. start showing them the more difficult issues? Well, guys come to us with all levels. You know, some have never flown okay, at all, and others that. come with maybe they already have their private pilot's license or their instrument rating or maybe right. even their commercial license. So working with guys we've even had missionaries come home off the field that uh we've had guys coming out of airlines you know trying to get in back into light airplanes so at whatever level they are we're just trying to get them the skills they need to yeah uh qualify to go with some of these sending organizations is this open for beginning flyers or what is the program open well, for basically any group everybody's got to start someplace right so you start at the beginning but what we do is we in the training course we we bring in about this mission flying and we get People from the missionaries who on furlough or mission reps come to our uh, hangar and talk to our students. And then when we we have an opportunity, because I've been working with a Bible camp, and Gary's been up there too now, up in western Alaska. There are no roads. And we take, that's our grad course. Mm-hmm. Once you get your commercial license, we'll get you up there we'll check you out on some of these village strips mm. and it's tough so there's a bible camp out there and all these eskimo villages along the river or along the bering sea there's no way for them to travel okay and, and, you know unless they've got a boat to go up river and so we would fly kids uh, and families to, the, to this bible camp so that's kind of like the, the graduation thing here they yeah. get to go out and then fly the kids yeah. to the bible so they're doing a real ministry and then they're also it's kind of training but it's, it's beyond yeah. your normal training it's really field yeah. operating in field conditions well, here's the website to go to mata-usa.org that's mata-usa.org gary and gordon appreciate you being on the show thank right, you very much God bless appreciate you. It.